What's going on folks? My name is Spice of the Spice Cab Fish. Today we're gonna go head on down to the ponds behind my apartment, see if we can get on a few fish. I got a couple hours today before the sun goes down and I don't really feel like driving anywhere so I figured we'd just go on down behind the ponds and uh, see if we can get lucky. Ponds haven't been fishing great this year. I don't know what the problem is. It's still kind of early in the season so I'm sure they'll pick up at some point or another but for right now at least they're not fishing great but hopefully we'll be able to get lucky and get a few bites. Got a little jerk bait tied on, I got a jig tied on, I got a little net rig tied on, got a whole bunch of other stuff that we'll be able to throw at these fish. Hopefully we'll be able to find something that these fish are looking for today. But yeah, nothing super interesting or fun about today's video, just going out for a few bites. Hopefully we'll be able to find a few and uh, hopefully crack back on a few largemouth. But yeah, I'm gonna get my stuff ready and uh, I'll meet you guys out at the pond. All right, folks, here we go. Just gonna start today's video out at the pond behind my apartment, uh, just because, well, I'm kind of lazy and I don't really feel like driving anywhere today, but I do want to go fishing. So that is what we're doing. There's a cat right there. That's a dog. Hey, buddy. Where is your owner? I don't see anybody around here to who this dog would belong to. Huh, that is so strange. He doesn't seem like a very friendly dog, so I don't really want to get close to him. Huh. Okay. Well, anyway, uh, I'm going to get to fishing. <laughs> I'm not going to mess with that dog anymore. I'm just going to try and get close to him to see if he's got a collar or something on. But anyway, I'm going to start with a little jig. See if we uh, can't get bit over here by this little piece of wood. Huh. That's very strange. I'm still so confused. The dog just like ran, it looked like it ran to someone's door. So maybe they just let their dog out for a sec. I don't, I don't know. I'm confused. I don't see it anymore. So whatever. Well, we're going to start off with a little black and blue jig, a little uh, chunk trailer on it and uh, see if we can't find ourselves a fish or two. Oh God, Jesus Christ. So there's a dead duck over here, or a dead goose over here in the water. And uh, I think that dog was like eating it or something. That is rancid. Yeah, I'm really happy I didn't get close to that dog now. Okay. Um, what an odd start to a fishing day. I'm gonna start again, like I said, by fishing over here by this tree, and then I'm gonna work my way down to the deeper part of the pond. But uh, I feel like there might be maybe a fish or two sitting up over here by this tree. Like you guys can probably tell I am in short sleeves right now. It's super nice. It's like mid 70s right now, which is stupid warm for the end of March. So I, I feel like this water should warm up a little bit and these fish should want to start moving shallow pretty soon. And uh, hopefully they're going to be a little bit more active today than they have in the past few days because I have not been able to get bit. I've been out fishing. I just I have not been able to get bit. But yeah, I got all the uh, late winter, early springtime classics tied on. I got a jig, got a jerk bait, I got a drop shot, which I could also switch up to a Ned rig. Uh, I've also got like a couple of lipless crankbaits and stuff like that in my bag. So I think we got a pretty good spread of stuff to throw at them today. Hopefully we'll be able to find one that wants to eat something. Oh, there we go. I'm on. I got one. I think it's a crappie. Oh, it is. Crappie. Nice one. Hell yeah. Oh, God. Second fish of the year is a nice, I don't know if it's a black or a white crappie, but it's some sort of crappie. There we go. Nice little crappie for the first fish of the day. I'll take that for sure. All right, buddy. Appreciate you. Have a good one. Whoa. You guys see that? You had like a freaking backflip. That was awesome. Hell yeah. First fish of the day is a crappie. I kept getting bit over here. I just couldn't get them to like commit or maybe they were just too big or too small, I mean. Uh, but I shortened up my presentation a little bit. I was throwing a full little drop shot worm then I shortened it up so it's like about half a drop shot worm. I also dyed the whole tail of the chartreuse to help it stand out a little bit more. And I'm sure you guys can't hear what I'm saying at all, but 
uh yeah that's what we did we got that finished made a little pitch up in front of this little grate over here and uh, buddy seemed to like it but yeah i've been a bit all over this little area right here there's probably a bunch of little crappie and stuff just sitting all over here so good to finally figure out what that was i didn't think they were actually bass it's still a little bit chilly for these bass uh, i think the water temp's only like high 40s maybe low 50s so these bass still aren't super super active but uh crappie seem to be so the fish around here for a little bit longer see if maybe we can cross paths with another decent sized crappie and if not then we'll go try and find some more bass or maybe we'll go just over somewhere else and try and catch some more crappie i don't really know figure it out though good first fish regardless i'll take that all day Oh, I got one. I got a fish. Oh, largemouth. Yes. <laughs> yes, sir. Hell yeah. Got us a green one. That's a big boy. Yeah, he's not too bad. Maybe a pound or so. Yeah. Very nice. Fat little guy. Oh my gosh. Hells yeah. Two fish on the day. I like that. All right, buddy, I'll let you go. Enjoy your spring, have some more crawfish, get bigger, and bite my bait again. Oh, awesome. There we go. Little large head on the day. You'll love that. That guy came on this little itty bitty net rig right here, casted it up shallow, and for some reason he was up there. Make another cast, see if we can find ourselves another one. Maybe they're up shallower than I'm giving them credit for. That was a little too shallow. All right, folks, I think I'm gonna call it for today. Oh, unfortunately, I think this rain is coming in. It's looking really gross out and it's starting to get kind of cold and windy. So I think I'm gonna call it for tonight. We did catch a couple of fish, lost a couple more, unfortunately, but it was a solid day of fishing today. I'm not gonna finish the video out on just a couple of fish. Like I said, I wanna catch at least three fish in every single one of my videos this year. So we're gonna go out tomorrow, see if we can get on at least one more. So yeah, I'll see you guys out at the pond tomorrow morning. Hopefully we can get on a couple more fish. The next day. All right, folks, day number two down here at the pond. I figured we'd just come on down here. Again, just got a couple hours before the sun goes down. And uh, I just brought one rod with a Nedrick tied on. We're gonna fish until either I lose this Nedrick or I catch a couple of fish and the sun goes down. I don't know whichever one's gonna come first, but we're gonna fish until at least two of those things happen. But yeah, just gonna fish around in this little area for a sec. Gonna fish the same areas that I got bed in yesterday and uh see if we can get that i'll try some other areas too obviously but i figure in the couple hours that we have before the sun fully sets we should probably be able to at least get bit once or twice especially on a net rig okay have officially seen a bass there's officially been a bass up shallow decent sized one too just sitting right here in this tree there's also a carp sitting right here too Bass spooked off, carp is not. Oh, there's a bite. Oh, I had one right there. I'm stuck in a tree. Okay, got it back. I got bit right there. Got him. I got one finally. Yes. Get up here, dude. 
<laughs> that was awesome. I watched him come up and smoke that little Ned Rig. Oh, finally. <laughs> yes. Little dude on a Nedley. Let's freaking go. Hmm, buddy's got something wrong with his bum hole. All right, I don't really want to throw him in over here because there's a bunch of rocks and stuff up real shallow. So we're going to walk over here just so I can get down in the water and let him go real nice and gentle like. All right, little buddy, I appreciate you making my fishing session worth it. You have a good one. Peace out. All right, folks, that's gonna do it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, do me a favor, go down below, hit that like button for me. Let's me know you guys like the content. Also, if you guys wanna see some more videos from me, you can hit that subscribe button down below as well. Overall, not a great day of fishing day. I got bit a few times actually in this same little area. I was only able to get that one to the bank today, but at least that was enough to finish out the video on a strong note. Really stoked that we were able to get that final fish. We were out here for, I wanna say like two hours or so. Sun is pretty much all the way down at this point. I've got maybe about 15 or 20 minutes until it is really, really dark out here. But yeah, again, I think that's gonna do it for me. I'll check and recommend. I'll catch you in the next one. I'm out, peace.